Hello everyone. Today I am going to describe about tax. We will do some numerical problem also. And we will also obtain formulas. I think this video will help you in your daily life as well as gaining marks in examination. Okay? Tax. Tax is a compulsory financial charge or some other type of levy imposed by a government or governmental organization. In Nepal, every tax activities like imposing tax, making tax policies, is done by Inland Revenue Department and some common taxes in Nepal are income tax, house and land tax, property tax, vehicle tax, value added tax, sales tax, import and export tax extra. Among them, I am going to give you some short description about value added tax. Value added tax is a tax on goods and services which falls on value added of each stage from the stage of production to retail stage. But value added tax is exempted on goods and services of basic needs, export and government services, education, health, extra i am going to give you uh, some numerical problems look at here here is one mobile and selling price of this mobile is rupees 40000 and this price is without using 30% 13% vat now we are going to find vat amount from this Look at here. Here is selling price of that mobile is rupees forty thousand, and bad percent is thirteen percent. Now bad amount equal to rupees thirteen percent of forty thousand rupees. Uh, so this is equal to thirteen percent means thirteen upon hundred and forty thousand rupees. And look at here uh, zero zero and last zero zero cancel. Then remaining number is 13 multiply 400 equal to 5200. This is that amount. And we are going to make formula from this. That amount equal to that percent of SP selling price. That percent use always that percent use on SP. SP with VAT now uh, total uh, amount, total selling price of that mobile or SP with VAT amount equal to 40,000 plus 5,200. This is equal to 45,200. Total cost of mobile with VAT equal to 45,200. And uh, so one other formula. Uh, SP with VAT equal to selling price plus VAT amount. And this is equal to selling price plus VAT amount. We can find VAT amount. We found VAT amount by using this formula. So we can use uh, formula selling price with VAT equal to SP plus VAT amount or SP plus VAT percent of SP. When VAT percent and selling price are given. Now look at another example. Uh, look at here. Here is one laptop and selling price of this laptop is rupees 70,000 and VAT amount equal to 10,500. Here VAT amount is given. So we are going to find a VAT percent of this mobile. Sorry, 
selling price of laptop equal to rupees seventy thousand and VAT amount equal to rupees ten thousand five hundred and VAT percent equal to VAT upon SP. I use this ratio because VAT amount or VAT is used on SP. It is compared with SP. So SP is written in denominator and VAT in numerator. And uh, VAT equal to VAT amount equal to rupees 10,500 and selling price equal to rupees 70,000. Uh, by cancelling this uh, uh, last uh, two zeros, two, two zeros, then remaining amount is 105 upon 700. Uh, and uh, I divided 700 by 7 for making 100 uh, equal to 107. Divide 700 equal to 100 and uh, 105 divide 7 equal to 15. And this is 15 upon 100 means 15%. Now uh, look at here uh, one other uh, formula. Bad percent equal to from above example we make this formula. Bad amount upon SP multiply 100 percent, and we can uh, use this formula also for finding um, bad percent. This is equal to by calculating this you can calculate. 15% uh, you can uh, we can find 15% now I am going to write above mention formulas first one is bad amount equal to bad percent of SP second selling price with bad equal to SP plus bad amount third SP with bad equal to SP plus bad percent of SP Fourth, SP with VAT equal to 100 plus VAT percent of SP. This is a new one. Uh, so, uh, if selling price equal to 100, then 100 plus VAT is equal to with SP with VAT. So, we can use this formula also. Uh, and fifth one is VAT percent equal to VAT amount upon SP multiply by 100%. Thank you. Please like and subscribe my video.